Hello, my name is Dr. Jeff Galini and welcome to another episode of Ask the Scientist. This show is about busting myths, bringing you the truth. Um, man, I am getting so many emails, Facebook messages about the whole keto thing. Um, I know I've been talking a lot about it and some people don't agree with me, but I don't care. Uh, my principles work and they're easy and they're things that you can do day in and day out. So here comes another message from Andrew from Washington and Andrew writes, what the heck is up with all this keto stuff? You're the only one I trust for you speak the truth. Please help me out on how to eat. Well, Andrew, you're absolutely right. This keto stuff is ridiculous. Uh, it's the same thing as the Atkins, the South Beach, I mean, all these fads. These companies are coming out with products in two categories. Number one, saying, oh, take this product and we will put you in a state of ketosis. I've seen the formulas. No, you don't. Don't buy those things. Then you got the other companies going, hey, we have a keto product. It contains no carbohydrates. Guess what? Most of them have protein. All protein contains some form of carbohydrates. They're lying to you. The other thing is, is just like Atkins, they have desserts, they have bars, they have cinnamon rolls. What are you supposed to do with that? So you're going to eat a normal diet and then you're going to think, oh, I'm going to go eat that keto dessert and I'm going to lose weight. No, you're not. You're going to gain weight. They're high in fat. I don't care that they don't put any sugar in there, but they are high in fat and high in calories. Only one way to have a healthy lifestyle is to control your eating habits. Moderations and a healthy diet. My principles work, I have proven them year in and year out. So many people have got on my plan and the first thing they say is, I am supposed to eat all this food and lose weight? Absolutely, it's about quality. You need protein. You've got to eat about six times a day. You need about a gram and a half per pound of body weight if you're trying to gain, if you're trying to maintain, about a gram. That's a lot of protein. Number two, you need to eat carbohydrates. That is what fuels your muscles for a workout. That is what gets your metabolism up. That's the kindling in the fireplace that stokes the energy. Um, you need to keep your fat down. Don't eat all this fat that these guys say. It's not healthy. I don't care what they say. It's not healthy to be eating a stick of butter and drinking oil and all the stupid things I've seen. Keep your fat down. Don't need sugar. Get rid of the sugar in your diet. Um, and stay away from processed foods, refined carbohydrates. Now, I like to incorporate a cheat day in my healthy eating plan. But anyhow, if you are interested on how to do this right, send me an email, drjdrj at allamph.com and absolutely free, I'm not gonna charge you three, four, five thousand dollars like these guys do, absolutely free, I will send you a plan that will show you how to eat to gain muscle and to metabolize body fat. I also will include a training plan so that you see what type of workouts you need to do and the fact that you need to do cardio. It's important. Um, these principles work, they're sound, you won't be hungry, you'll grow, you'll look good, you'll feel good. And that's what it's all about. Feeling good, looking good, right? Health. You should have a smile on your face when you are training. Not be like these keto junkies that are sad and depressed and angry and, and mean. Forget that, man. You know, I like to be happy. I like to eat and you can eat, be happy, gain muscle and lose body fat all at the same time. All right, hope that helps. Take care and I'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.